Hello everyone, Alaska here, and I want to bring you a light language video. Um, I have already connected to Source and to Gaia, but I'll get to that in a minute. I wanted to um, bring up a few things. Um, I did have another um, donation sent to my PayPal, so I want to say thank you for that. Um, I, I won't say names, but that's kind of something that I wanted to address on here. Um, if you happen to send me a donation, please um, put in the little box whether you mind whether I say your name or not. Um, that will help um, know where it stands, um, if you really want it um, put out there or not. Uh, if you do, I would love to say it. Thank you. I'm so appreciative of donations. I do not charge money for my services. I have made um, videos for people in need. Um, I've done lots of different stuff. I make these videos to help. So donations are wonderful. So thank you again for those. Um, I wanted to mention, if you notice, I am not at home. I am in Mobile and they had the Mardi Gras here tonight. So something that really caught my attention during the Mardi Gras was there are so many floats that were um, Egypt based. There was one of a Sphinx, just so many different ones, and I got pictures of that. So if you follow me on Facebook, you will see um, these floats. It kind of was mind-blowing. I have had so many synchronicities today of uh, 144, 1044, 1144, and some of them I have posted to my Facebook as well. So it's just energies are super strong today. We have the full moon coming in too. So I hope everybody is grounding. I know I definitely need it. This is probably my third attempt at making this video. Um, I do have my husband here next to me. He is kind of sick. Um, he's kind of watching his iPad, kind of dozing off and on. He's really not feeling good. But this will be my first video to make in front of him, so this should be interesting. Um, also, uh, I did connect with Source and Gaia. When I connected to the Source, um, I did see a gold color. Usually the colors come when I connect with Gaia, but I did notice I took my cord and put it through the opening in source. I did see Archangel Michael and Christ. Um, I did get the gold. With the gold, I got Christ consciousness. Usually it's yellow, but I did feel that with the gold. When I wrapped it on Gaia's crystal heart, it was still the gold. I breathed the gold up, connected them, kind of made a pillar of gold um, from me and to Gaia to source. So I think um, that's really it. And um, we might have avian energy come through here. I did pick them up on the second time that I connected with Source and Guy because I did. This is my third attempt to make this video. And I am seeing wings, so that could be avian it could be angel it could be both and i am the wings i'm seeing them again i'm really not sure they might be bird wings but they're it's kind of odd they look layered of something jitagista. They could be both on top of each other. Jitagata erata an. Jiti jitaku. Untakata erata ya. Astakata ita. Atakata an. And I, you know, it, it just dawned on me why I'm, I could be. I did um kind of work on my husband two days ago and he has strong avian energy. He. I, I don't know how many pictures I have of him just holding birds, finding birds. Birds just, they love him. They're not afraid of him at all. Um, I, they're like, they perch on his hand. So it could be with him sitting next to me why I'm picking it up. Oh, 
I'm going to put this. And I'm getting really drawn to the heart space and the throat. But I'm going to put this. And I'm going to put this. And I'm going to put this. Um, I am seeing a pyramid. Now, I, with all of these Egypt, Egyptian type themes that I saw in the Mardi Gras, I, I really can't even tell you how many floats that were all based off of Egypt. It, it, I can't tell you how mind blowing it is either, but um, I am seeing a pyramid. When I was watching the parade, I couldn't help but feel like it, it's within the timelines. It's almost kind of like a theme and it's going so far out from us. It's it's really reaching so many people. And I keep getting timeline and I and I feel that I, I don't even know. It Egyptian timeline here and then now. I don't know if we're crossing timelines with one that had previously existed. I'm seeing the sun. And I'm here in council and I, I, it's almost like I'm having the last few videos almost starting to kind of collide within my mind and it's all possibly all tied to the same thing. I really think it may be tied. Even with the avian and um, the lion that came to me, the lion being when I connected um, to Source last video. I really feel like this council, the Egypt timelines, I really feel like they're all connected and they're all, it's just pieces that are building upon each other that are coming to all, to all the people who watch these videos, my videos, other videos, because I notice I'm not the only one talking about this. So it's really kind of all fitting together. And I'm again drawn to the heart. And I did hear the word codes. Um, and each word that I'm saying, I'm seeing a bird, but it's kind of almost like um, like a hieroglyph or something. So almost kind of like the Egypt thing again. And I just noticed on these blankets, there's like a pattern. It looks like crosses all over. And I think that Christ consciousness is really kind of more wanting to make itself known again. It's the reason why I kind of saw it out of the corner of my eyes. Like I said, all tied in. And I'm getting mind, which to me is almost like um, I think these codes like are gonna unlock something. And I and I've mentioned this in a previous video, with I I feel the timelines that were that are being brought up that we've been through, experienced before, are going to start revealing themselves to us. So with the mind, I could actually see, see something, which hopefully means you'll be seeing something that is related to this timeline for you. And I did see a bird, but then I saw a cat, and then a bird, and the cat.
vždy zdukotuje va. Vete a teka te arate a stada va teka tenda. Vote ka te sta es tukoto o, tukoto o, tukoto o, tukoto o, And I'm, it's really hard, I don't know if I can explain that. I saw a cat fit above, it almost looked like a little rope, but um, I think it's a light language symbol. It's kind of like a little squiggly kind of thing. Um, I will try to draw and put it on my page, on my Facebook page, so if you follow me there. Um, look tomorrow for this thing, because I don't have any paper pen on me, but I will post it tomorrow. Um, it's like over, loop, up, loop, over, kind of loop. And actually, when I said cord earlier, I had mentioned a, a gold cord that had came from me to source and that was connecting us. This thing that I saw, this light language symbol, this sort of thing, almost looked like a gold cord. Okay. I did see a pyramid again when I was speaking that, but I think it's all related, it's all tied in, it's all kind of repeating along with the codes, just kind of, I feel like more like with the, um, when I was talking about the DNA activations, kind of locking, popping, clicking back into place. I think um, that's kind of more of what these codes are doing, just kind of more adjustments is what I'm getting, adjusting. So, yes, that's exactly what it is, adjustments. So, um, I hope that this helps you. I hope that um, anything that you're needing to help see these timelines um, is brought through with this video. If you're new, thank you so much for watching. If you've returned, thank you so much for coming back. Much love, much blessings, and have a wonderful night.